go to sleep. Yeah. <laughs> What's up? What's up? We're in the hospital. What? We're not giving birth though. <laughs> <laughs> it was funny. <laughs> Dad is in the hospital because he had a fall. He's over there. Dad, say hi to the camera. Say hi. There you go. Good job. Yeah. What happened to you, Dad? Tell the camera what happened. Up. Put your arm down. What happened to you? Tell her. No, you. We want to hear it from you. What happened? I fell down from the... Uh, from where? From the bed going to the dresser. You hit your head? And Let then and then what happened? I hurt my head. <laughs> you hurt your head? And what else did you hurt? What else? What's the, what, you're my, having a surgery tomorrow. My arm and my legs were uh, twisted backward. Twisted. <laughs> you had to have a pacemaker put in, right? Pacemaker? I have a pacemaker right now. Yeah. Uh, your hands. Show them your hands. I can. oh, can't. Move it. Can't move it. And then your legs. Can you try to lift up your leg? There. The other one. Okay. So your head is better. Really? It's better. Oh. Your suga. Let me see. <laughs> You're just. You're gonna see. You're not gonna You're see gonna anything. See You're gonna see Krishna. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> We're just recording his head. So bullish. So tomorrow he has his uh, surgery on his back. C4 to C6. So it's a dangerous surgery, but I think should be okay. And then after his surgery, he'll go to rehab for therapy. Because he has a has trouble walking and standing, standing up. He didn't move his bowels for a whole week. And he moved it today and it was disgusting. You can use it today if you want. The neck brace. Okay. You can use it when you sleep tonight. Huh? Well, you're on your surgery tomorrow, so... Okay. Should be good. Okay. Just think positive at, uh, tonight and tomorrow. Don't think about anything.
Tatay oh. fell, right? So yeah, end of March. Do I have to record myself? Yes. I, I don't want to. So end of March, Tatay fell from the bed. End of March, like March says it was a Sunday morning. Uh, Mikey woke us up saying dad fell in his room. He was trying to get up for the morning and he said that he had a had a, um, a hard time getting out of bed but when he got out either he tripped or he fell like slipped and fell and he was on the ground for like 30 minutes or so until Mikey woke up and heard him calling for help um, and so when we turned him they turned him over he was bleeding from the he had a gash on his head and a cut on his nose and he couldn't move his arms and his legs so we called the ambulance and then they brought him so supposedly we think he hit his head on the dresser um, that's how he got the gash and the cut on his face his nose we don't know the reason why he f real reason why he fell he doesn't remember really because of his dementia so he's been in the hospital since March oh, March 27 um, March 27 he's been in the ho he was in the hospital for like two to three weeks right hops and then he got transferred to the rehab for therapy. Um, he's doing better, much better with therapy. He's walking with the walker, with, you know, with just a little bit of assistance. Um, his right is the weak, weaker side than the left. He can't really open up his fingers, his, stretch out his hands. Um, but he's doing much, much, much better with the therapy. He's doing OT, speech, and PT every day. Almost every day he gets a day off, one day off during the week. Uh, he should be coming home May 9th, um, and then he'll have home health come see him for therapy again, and a nurse will come out, make sure he's taking all his meds. He does have a UTI at the moment, so he's on antibiotics because he had a fever a few days ago. But um, he's 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 better. Just we have to remind him of stuff. You know, his dementia feels like it's getting a little bit worse or not so good. But we just have to remind him of stuff. But we'll um show you some photos and videos of him doing his therapy okay so that's what's been going on the past well it's been over a month now with dad so he should be coming home being discharged on May 9th and then we'll keep you updated on his which I think will be good. It will just take time for him to probably walk on his own again. You know, he won't be able to drive really for a while maybe. I don't know if, I don't know if he'll ever get to drive again. Which was his only way of, you know, releasing stress. Okay guys, thank you so much. It's been a while we've been that we uh, posted a vlog, but we're hanging in there. Okay guys, peace out, we're going to grocery. Have a good day.